Hey, what's up guys? Back with another video. Well, pretty much my first video of 2022. Just want to say Happy New Year, Merry Christmas. Hope you all had a lovely holiday break, wherever you are. But in this video, I'm going to show you the best controller keyboard settings you got. I play controller and keyboard, but I'm, I prefer keyboard because I'm more used to keyboard. Um, I, I'm starting to play controller a bit, but I'm just waiting for control freaks because I sold. I had my other PC last time, and I was using a um, control freak on so my PS5 controller, and that went pretty good. So I'm probably going to get another PS5 controller and a control freak. So at the moment, I'm just using a red Xbox controller. But anyway, enough to it. Let's get into the video. So we're going to start off just at your graphic settings. If you play a PC, you obviously know what this is. Um, I personally, I just I heard full screens a bit better. But I just play windowed because if you run two monitor monitors like I do, once you click the other monitor, it goes blank, and that pisses me off. So I just stay in windowed. I don't really notice the difference. But I got a 240Hz monitor, but I decided to keep it at 180 as I don't not get a solid 180. I actually just took 240. I mean, I'll put it at 200 to see how I go in there. But brightness is stuck on 100. Same with whatever this is. I'm not on. Not sure what that is, don't understand it. I play Protonope colorblind mode. I'm not colorblind, so, but I just like that mode. Um, my colorblind strength is 7. My 3D resolution is 100. My view distance is near. Same with bloody textures. My meshes are low. I heard high meshes. I'm pretty sure it's mobile builds. I'm not sh too sure yet. No, no, bubble builds. Not, not mobile builds. Yeah, bubble builds. I don't think it's bubble builds, actually. But I want the bubble builds back. Bubble builds. Bubble. Sounds weird, eh? I don't, I don't recommend turning V-Sync on. I heard V-Sync is not... It's like meant to make a game more smoother, but it doesn't. Obviously, I'm on performance mode. You got to... You, you know what it is. Um, unfortunately, I'm in Australia and my ping sucks. Uh, toggle sprint off. Sprint by default on, always, if you don't play with Sprint by default on, bro, you're missing out. Like, you need Sprint by default. It makes your life so much more easier. And turn this setting off, whatever you do. Do not have this setting on. It's disgusting. What open doors? Uh, this is alright in some cases, but, like, say when you're in a final box, and then you, like, accidentally open the door, boom, headshot, done. Back to the lobby. Hold to pick up? Oh, I love this one so much. That, that, that's got to stay on. Toggle targeting off, mark danger and targeting on. Pick up, auto pick up, no, turn this off straight away. My preferred arm slots is just this. This is the way I want it. You don't have to copy me, you can if you want to, but yeah, this is the way I like it. Um, auto, cons or, this is pretty pointless if you got that, but I'd just like to keep it on just in case. With building, I keep reset building choice off. Same, and then the rest on disable pre-edit, turbo building, and confirm edit. If you do not have confirm edit on release, like just just stop playing the game. You need to you need edit on release. Like you can't live without it. Same with turbo. Oh my god, I remember the time when they removed turbo building. Building, it was the worst. Like they changed. I'm pretty sure they changed it within like a day because they made a mistake. Their excuse was it was for new players, but pissed off all the good players. No offense. Sorry, I don't know what that is. That's off. Off. I don't really play creative much. I don't make maps. Nvidia highlights. Uh, this is alright, but like, uh, you just download a third-party software. I like to call Overwolf or Metal for your game clips. And replay is always off. Uses game data. My hard scale is at 70%. My and everything is on besides. Runtime performance stats. So just put everything on. I like that. You need you sort of need everything. Your ping, bro. That's the best. I love how they added the ping. So uh, currently I'm on a 240 hertz monitor. So this is probably better for the PC players on like 165 hertz plus or 144. Because if you play on a 60 hertz monitor, you're not. This is not going to feel as fast. But because it's 13 and I'm on a 240 hertz, it's more smooth for me. So it feels fast. So I'm. Um, I've stuck mine at 13. 24.2 and 29.4 Don't ask for either so random numbers. I just click 24 and 29 and whatever they landed on done it I'm not sure what this these two are, but I just kept them off same with these ones 
now down to my controller. I have controller auto on, yes. Boda Pro, yes, obviously. What? Oh, this is the slide button. Okay. Yeah, I just, I didn't know that it was there. But that's just stuck at whatever, 1.1, that's 0 0.100. Oh, well, this doesn't really matter to me because I've got a, my edit button. My edits have changed. I've got my dialogue stick as my edit button. My oh, vibration's off. I hate vibration. Um, my build sen sensitivity is at 2. My edit mode sensitivity is at 1.6. Use advanced options, yes. And my look horizontal speed is at 42, while my look vertical speed is at 43. The, wait, turn, turn all the boosts off to 0%. Same, yeah, all the boosts. Is off and my ADS look horizontal speed is 7, 7, and 8, 8. And then another boost, 0. Damping time, 0. Uh, I heard, I'm pretty sure exponential is better for a long range and linear is better for close range. I prefer linear, it just makes you feel like more of a PC player than Expo because Expo, you're like, it's all stiff. I feel like it's all stiff, but with linear, you're like more free, you know what I mean? You'll try it and then you'll see what I mean. My dead zone, this is different for everyone, it depends on what controller and how old your controller is, but mine's at 1717, well, now it's at 1717. My foot controller's off, because I don't need a foot controller. My volume, don't need to really get much of this, but I pretty much just turn my music off, that's it. Sound quality, always kept it high. 3D headphones, not nah, because then you don't have visuals. I do? Might do. I don't know. Background audio, notifications only. Subtitles, just turn that off, I reckon. Subtitles off, yep. Actually, I'll keep that on. Um, Visualize sound effects, you need this, bro. This is the best setting when it's came out. Like, I use this. I'm pretty sure it came out like season five. I've been using this ever since and it just helped me so much. Whatever set you are, like the rig, whatever headset you're using, this is to hear game, game audio. My voice chat is on, voice chat method, open mic. You can do push to talk, like I stream on YouTube pretty much every day, so it can get useful, but I don't have a keybind for that, so I just put on open mic. Voice chat, I like to keep this default because it gets very complicated if you don't know what you're doing. I know what I'm doing, but like some of the viewers might not know. Party or game, I prefer party, voice chat notifications off, and license audio play. So now to my keyboard settings, ma, it's different to everyone, but this is what I play if you want to copy it. I'm not going to say it because it's a lot to say, but yeah, here you go. It's just WASD for my right, forward, spacebar jump, sprint, I got auto sprint, don't need it. Auto run, never knew I had that. Crouch, left shift, now down to five. If you want to copy these, go for it, mate. You'll love them. Once you get used to it, because like with all keybinds, you have to get used to it. These keybinds I've used ever since season chapter two. So I was taking a drink. My fire and target buttons, obviously. The mouse buttons, I use R as my reload, left alt. This might be awkward for some people, but it's because I use E as my edit button. I didn't know what to use, for, use, but I found left alt for use is pretty good. I use F for my harvesting tool and then one and two for my two slots. And then I use my front mouse button. I've got a Razor Death out of V2, so they've got two buttons, one at the front, one at the back. So I use the front button for my shotgun, and then my up button for my... Wait, what do I use my up button? My cone in my building, my cone. And then I use T for my snipers, or like the last fifth slot, you know what I mean? Yep, left, slip, left shift as well. War, Q, Floor, X, TSC. Now, Roof is my back mouse button. I find that very handy. It's so much more easier to get to your, like, builds. Uh, trap is the middle mouse button. I'll just press it. That's so easy. Repel, credits, etc., etc. My building at R plus R is E. I suggest using E with something close to W. E, Q, maybe G. If you're using G, I'd suggest changing that. I used to use G for about like six months and then I used E and now I'm so much more easier to edit. And I use mouse wheel down as well because this is scroll down reset. If you don't know how to do that, just copy this. <coughs> My ping is three because I don't need three. 
Uh, I'm just going to like mention out the important ones, not like every single one. My emote is G. I like that. Etc. Uh, Etc. Et it's pretty much the same. Pretty much the same. Toggle map, obviously M. Toggle inventory tab for vehicles. Uh, this will all be different to use, so I'll just skip that. Now down to my keyboard settings. Controller settings, sorry. So, um, nothing much has changed besides my edit button is the W, the, the dot left dialog. Uh, is that it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. I haven't changed much on my controller. I play an Xbox one, but I like to put it as a PlayStation 4 because it just looks better than Xbox, you know what I mean? This, no, I shouldn't show that. Play surveys, I keep that on. I just like to get surveys every now and then. Makes me feel special. Mature language filter, I put that on. I don't know why. Friend invite permission. Anyone can invite me. Hide your link names, no. Because I don't have any links besides my Xbox, which I don't play because I sold it. Show texture on. Show social notifications on. Can receive gifts. Oh, mate, if you, if you have this off, don't know what you're doing, mate. You need the gifts. You need the gifts, especially around the holiday time. Show career on leaderboard, yes. And then mode. This used to be called streamer mode. Like if this, if they still had streamer mode, I would have kept it as streamer mode because I love streamer mode a lot. Like it was the best. It said like Red Knight 234, Black Knight 236, Skull Trooper 130. Now it just says Anonymous 369. So she's in level one's feed. Ah. Uh, yeah, no, I'll turn that on. You don't have to. Or this is just like up to personal preference. Hide other players' names. Nah. Uh, I played seven. I just put that on, obviously. But because I'm streaming, I don't get any views. But yeah, that was mainly the whole video. In my next video, I might just like show off my locker. It's not, it's not, I, I, oh, no. Nah. Oh, yeah, Epic Games, if you see this video, I had 240 skins. I swear I had 240 skins, but now I've only got 217. Can you please explain what happened there? Did you remove skins? Did you take skins from my account? Because if you did, I would want my V-Box back, mate. Because I can swear to you, I had 250. Close to 250. I did not have 217. But anyway, enough of that. Um, Yeah, uh, I might as well show my career. On here, hey, when did um, chapter one come out? Oh, it doesn't say, does it? Yes, so the 17th of the 10th, 19th. Ah, that's so weird. Where was chapter two? This is chapter two, I think. Yes, bro. I reckon chapter two, season two, was the best season yet, bro. Just looking at my breaks, bro. What's my most recent break? 17 days. No, that can't be it. 67 days. Because I just sold my PC for like a good month or so. But here's my stats. It's not the best. I've only got 42 solo wins. 269 top 10. 601 top 25. I've got 3,461 eliminations. Matches played 2,458. Duo, I've got 69 wins. I want to keep it as that. Nah, I'm joking. I got 348 wins, 888 top 12, no, 348 top 5, 6,109 eliminations and 5,110. Squad, I've got 224 wins, no, I do not get carried, I do not know why I have so much more wins without solo in the way. I've got 535 top 3, 1,021 top 6, 8,000 eliminations and 6,174 matches played. Did they got trios? No, they don't have trios. Weird. LTM. 10,000 kills in LTM. Damn. Anyway, so that's enough of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that big red subscribe button and also stream and put a lot of effort into my videos. Um, leave a like and leave a comment if you want me to approve of anything or just like make a video suggestion. So, on that note, catch is gone. Thank you for watching the video.
If you could please leave a like and hit that big red subscribe button I would appreciate it a lot.